to win on his own? Or is Philboard able to keep the chances of Mouse Sports alive? We will find out here on Tarina stand. And um, yeah, good luck. How is it? Um, <laughs> better. Yeah, that was a problem back in those days. Because um, there were no such thing as hotspots uh, uh, or even the GG client was not around. So yeah, they needed to find a host which was suitable for both players and Russia against Australia. Yeah. Eh. Eh. Mm. Uh, kind of hard to find a good host for both players. But anyway, um, let's see how this game will turn out. Bottom right, we have Failbot, aka Bank Your Gal, Mi Araldo, and he is. Oh, I messed up the colors. Ah, wait a second. Wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. That man is blue. And Failbot is orange. Okay, sorry for the confusion. There we go. And yeah, as predicted, Philbot is going for Fiends here, Crypt, Graveyard, um, yeah, Altar of Darkness, Cigarette, and the Tube of Relic. So Fiends it is. And um, yeah, let's see. Dead man. Top left here. He's going for the Demon Hunter as the first hero. And uh, yeah, plays his Ancient of War. Next to the Goblin Laboratory, we will, where he will start the first creep camp in a you know, couple of seconds. And uh, the problem I had with Terina's stand was uh, this little thing here. Well, not only this little thing here, but also this mercenary camp. Because um, on this little plateau here, uh, yeah, you could drop some demolishes and attack the gold mine. Of the player starting here, which was yeah not too nice, I have to say. And um, this motion camp was also changed because you were able to get a end snare and a poison creep early on. So yeah, with a wisp pull, uh, getting those units early on, that's also very tough for your opponent then. But anyway, Goblin Laboratory getting crept by the Knight of Player. Ring protection plus two for the DH. Gauntlets of August strength. Second item and the level up for that man's first hero. Philbot uh, finally out with his first hero. He has two cigarettes, pumping the fiends out. And um, yeah, now taking the first creep camp here. In the middle of the map, he's going for the kobolds. He's trying to get the first experience points. Even using a coil here to finish the Geomancer a little bit quicker, but the Demon Hunter is close by. Is he seeing the other player though? No, he is not. So Philbot is able to finish this creep camp here. And that man is going on the offensive. He's going for the Mamis of the other player, but yeah, Fiends attacking the archers now. Demon Hunter is trying to get a mana burn. On the DK gets it, but the DK also using a coil to yeah hit the demon hunter at least a little bit. Let's see, that man is taking two tier two. Huntress Hall is in production, so yeah, looks like two lore strides bears. Nice whisper made here by a dead man. DK still on level one. And yeah, and the player is attacking now as well. Getting another cigarette. And let's see. What is dead man going for next? He's going for the rogue wizard camp here. Using the mono burn. Deal a little bit of a little bit more damage. Gets a manual of health as a reward. And the player. Oh next wisp detonate here. Two dead skeletal warriors. And uh, yeah, that's almost level two and a half here for the demon hunter. Let's see. 
Miraldo, aka Fullbot, now creeping the Goblin Laboratory here. Gets the Gloss of Haste and the level 2. Tier 2 tech, about 60% done here. Knight of Player now creeping the Goblin Merchant. Gets a Wine of Illusion and he's going for an expansion dab, man. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. He's a tier 2. He gets a Priestess of the Moon, old version upgrade, and one Ancient of Lore. Okay, so probably going for. Yeah, Dryads? Mass range units? Would make sense with the Priestess and the Aura first. Now let's see. Full bot, close to level 3 now. Gets level 3 in this moment. Goblin Merchant. I gave him a replenishment potion, which is not too shabby for the DK here, because, um, yeah, there's no good way to heal up the undead heroes. There's no sacrificial dagger and stuff like that, so that's kind of hard to do. Dead man creeping. His gold mine now. Level three and a half here. Two of strength for. The Knight of First here, and there we go, there's the Priestess with the True Shot Aura. Tree of Life almost finished here. And uh, Phil Watts taking some more creep camps. Claws of Attack plus 6 for the DK. Let's see. Phil so is Tier 2, gets the Lich. Gets another Recolite, that's interesting. So maybe also going for an expansion here. Or is he getting a sacrificial pit now? Ah, oh, getting a slaughterhouse, okay. Level well, three and a half DK. Potem now taking some more creep camps here. Trying to get the level up. Ancient of War, uh, Ancient of War. What the hell, Tree of Life is finished. And now walking to the gold mine here. And there we go, yeah, it's an Ancient of Lore and an Ancient of Wind, so mass range units here for that man. And uh, yeah, Philbot in the meantime, still staying with those fiends, waiting for the Slaughterhouse to finish. Gets a Sacrificial Pit as well, Lich is out, and the tier 3 tech gets started. Demon Hunter now checking if he's able to find the under player, but he's on the other side of the map. Pot him. Finishing the gold mine here, gets the level 2. And the expansion of that man gets entangled. Oh, mana burn used on the Lich here. So that's one Frost Nova gone already. Philbot scouting with a skeleton warrior here, that gets killed. Coil used on the Demon Hunter. Well, yeah, better to use it this way than to get the mana burned. And yeah. Cobalt Taskmaster now getting attacked here at the mercenary camp. What's the item? Potion of Greater Healing. That's not too shabby. Demon Hunter is coming in. Coil Nova used immediately before the first uh, mana burn connects. Uh, but the DK. He's going back. Oh, and the dries are coming in for that man now. So that's a dead fiend right there. Lich trying to do something here, but yeah, he's blocking the fiend. That gets at least another Nova out of there. Crip fiend for Philbot is getting attacked. There's a coil. There is another coil. And the first obsidian statue now. Tier 3 tech almost finished. What happened to the Acolyte? Is he still around or is he a shade? Yeah, he's a shade. There we go. And yeah, he's now staying with the Knight of Army. That man stays at tier 2. Gets another attack upgrade. Will be the second one for him. Uh, and the player is going in. Coil gets used. To get another archer kill, and yeah, Deadman even TPing out of the situation was not willing to fight here. A 
player's forces are under attack. And full bot now creeping the next gold mine. And there we go. Creep check now by Deadman. Lionhorn of Stormwind still lying around. Mana burn used on the DK. And Philbot is pushed back here. Ooh, we'll lose a fiend, that's for sure. There we go, level 4 for the Demon Hunter now. A player's forces are under attack. Archers with the second attack upgrade. Is Deadman getting some more? No, he's not. I'm still not sure if the other player is aware of the expansion here. Potem trying to get the level 3. There we go. There's the level 3 and there's the level 2. Two short aura. So plus 4 damage now on those archers. And yeah. Philbot staying at 50 supply. One attack upgrade is ready. He's getting another obsidian statue. But I don't think that... Edwin will wait here any longer. He's attacking the main base of Philbot. He's going for the sacrificial pit here. The stories are getting morphed. Dead man, 65 supply. Maybe even going for another expansion now. Well, not quite. Oh, Philbot moving out with the statue in front. That's not a good idea. Oh, there's the Crypt Lord. <laughs> this impaling only hitting two units because they're all the hunts. Uh, all the hunts, all the drides were in the way. Yeah, Todd rides it. Impale for two units. Scroll of Healing was used. This is not looking good for Philbot. He's losing more and more units. Destroyer is about to drop as well. Gets Microbat. What about the Lich? Lich is in trouble. Lich gets focused. Lich going back. Lost it by... The Priestess of the Moon and that man is TPing out. Gets another destroyer kill as well. But uh, yeah. Philbot at the end still was able to get some kills. So that man, well, not really down to 62 supply, but yeah, he lost a handful of units there. And Philbot still with the fiends. One statue remaining and the Crypt Lord. Yeah. Sounds like a good idea, but the Impale against the Dryads. Not too effective. There we go. Scattered Warriors now. Scouting, but they won't even reach the gold mine of the Night of Player. They ran out of time but with the shade I think he should be well aware of the expansion now which is getting revived 56 supply for BenQ Gal Miraldo and SK that man we're well, killing some more creeps here almost crept the whole map only a few small camps here the small camp here and the Morlocks here Besides that, I think everything is crept here on Tarinas. Yeah, looks like it. Priestress with two scrolls of healing. TK still with the big healing potion. Lich is out once again. 59 supply for the under player, 67 for that man. And um, yeah, looks like that man is able to win against Mouseport single-handedly. Slippers of Agility plus three, getting dropped now. Second to last creep spot. Destroyer gets more of the first one. And I think we will get the next or maybe the last fight here. Let's see, yeah, also saying last fight Impale. 
Hits way better than the first one, but the Crypt Lord is getting focused heavily. Healing potion transferred, used. Coil is needed, but the Crypt Lord still going down. This focus fire is so super effective. Invo potion used. Mana burn focused on the DK. TP out. What the hell? This damage is just insane. Oh boy. That hurt. That hurt a lot. DK almost died. The Crypt Lord, he used the big healing potion. He got the coil still going down. And this boy has a lot of hit points. It's not like he's an intelligence hero or agility hero or something like that. No. Oof. Yeah, 2-1 upgrades now. Chat is talking about it. Next attack upgrade also in the pipeline here. And yeah, the main gold mines, well, still about 3,000 gold remaining. Yeah, and full bot still going for obsidian statues. Mm, don't think that it is the best idea. Maybe switching for apples would have been better. Yeah, but still. I think that this would make a big difference here in this game. 66 supply for that man. Expansion is running. He's getting a second one now. And the Arnett army is moving out once again. Focus on the Demon Hunter. Coil Nova. Focus on the TK. <laughs> no infant items in inventory. Beautiful and pale though. By the Crypt Lord. Priest is getting focused. Okay. The admin is just right clicking heroes here. Scroll of healing gets used. DK goes down. Goo is now also mo joining the fun here. And once again, a beautiful impale. Demon Hunter gets the level 5. Lich goes down. And that's... Oh boy. That's a slaughter right there. Crypt Lord was up in the air. Now fighting. But yeah, every unit. That man is right clicking. Goes down in a matter of seconds here. This is an insane damage output right there. Ghouls going down. Now we see the level 2 Crypt Lord getting focused. And he goes down. And this should be the GG. And uh, yeah, it is the GG by Filmbot.